Hey everybody, it's Holly and welcome back to our channel. Did you hear the news today? Did you hear the big world news? That's right, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have welcomed a brand new royal baby today. That's right, they had a baby boy. The world has been on royal baby watch for a while because they're a little bit overdue, but this morning, Meghan Markle had a baby boy, seven pounds, three ounces. Now, Prince Harry, Meghan Markle, you know Meghan Markle is from, she was one of the suitcase girls in the game show, then she was the star of Suits, and now she's the Duchess of Sussex. That's right, she married Prince Harry, and did you see Prince Harry's reaction to his wife giving birth? It was the cutest. He said something along the lines of, he doesn't know how women do what they do. It's just uncomprehensible. It was so cute. At least he gave her props. I mean, it's hard work to have a baby. So this right here is the video. Just let's take a second and watch his reaction. The most amazing experience I could ever have um, Seriously, how imagine. cute is he? Um, how any woman does what they do is beyond comprehension, but we're both. So I decided today because First of all, we have a new mom in the world with Megan, and Mother's Day is this Sunday. I would give you some really great ideas for a gift for your own mother. That's right, that's what I'm gonna do today. You can't go wrong with one of these gifts. These are some of my favorite things, some of the things that I have that I love, and some will work for a grandmother, some will work with a mother, some will work for yourself. They're so great. So I'm gonna give you some ideas in case you are scrambling and you still don't have a Mother's Day gift yet. And if dads, you're watching, remember Mother's Day is before Father's Day. You screw this up, you can guarantee Father's Day isn't gonna be good for you. So the first thing I would say is, this is, I love these. Get your mom a new bag. This jujube bag, I love this one. Get her something of her own style. Maybe let her pick it out, maybe surprise her. I would go with the surprising her because having a mom pick out her own thing kind of takes it out of this, like the excitement of it when you have to pick your own thing out. So um, I love this bag. Jujube has tons of bags. And this one, if you're like, I don't want to spend that much money, then go for something smaller. Like this is their B set. It's a collection of three bags that she could use for her makeup or as a little purse or a change purse. I absolutely love bags. I love whether it's a makeup bag or a purse or a diaper bag, get her a new bag. I know she might have a bag already, but moms can always use another one, right? So new bag. Now this next one is something we just got and I absolutely love these. These are the Lucy D Bluetooth sunglasses. And you're like, what is special about these sunglasses, Holly? Well, first of all, they're Bluetooth, so they're music sunglasses. So you can play music on your sunglasses. You don't have to plug them in. They're Bluetooth to connect in your phone so you can listen to Spotify or she can listen to her favorite music. You can wear them during sports. I wear them to play tennis with my kids because you're like on the other side of the court. You're listening to your own music. Moms can wear these when the kids are bickering. Now you have to listen a little bit so nobody like gets really hurt, but you really don't want to listen to the bickering. So you turn your music on, your headphones, you can still hear a little, but you're focusing on your music. You can also talk on the phone with these things and they're pretty cute, I would say, and they're comfortable and you can swipe to go from song to song. Actually, the swipe is over here. You can turn the music up and down. They're called Lucy D. They're the Lucy D loud sunglasses. I love them, and actually, since we got these, they're coming out with new trendy colors, which I hope they would, because I was like, I would love like a pink or a blue one, so if your mom likes to wear sunglasses, like I said, these are super comfortable, they're not super heavy, but they have built-in speakers, so she can listen to her own music. Let's say you're going on a road trip, everybody else is listening to some music she's not really fond of in the car, she's over in her seat, jamming out to her own music. I'm telling you, the Lucy D Loud sunglasses are a hit. Now, the third thing I would tell you is get a cool, cute piece of accent furniture. And you're like, that's hard to do. I know, it is hard to do, but if your mom is a little bit trendy, she loves her furniture, this chair is my new favorite chair. This chair is from Urban Outfitter. It's a swirl chair that I can turn. It's a great accent piece in my office. It's pink, which I love. And surprisingly, it's super comfortable. I bought it from Urban Outfitters online, didn't know how comfortable it'd be, but it's super cute and super comfortable. And it has like a rose gold uh, base on it. Really, really cute. I'm telling you, if your mom is kind of in that kind of thing with the furniture or the accent pieces, maybe she doesn't have a home office. Maybe she has a cute space in her room or somewhere. That's always an option. 
Now, one of my other favorite things is my blender. <laughs> You're like, really, Holly, a blender for Fat Mother's Day? Let me tell you, my Vitamix, I use every single day. I've used every single day for probably eight years. I drink a lot of smoothies. If your mom drinks a lot of smoothies, makes a lot of shakes, you can make Play-Doh and soup and everything in the Vitamix. I love my Vitamix. And it is a little expensive, but like I said, I've used mine every day for probably eight years straight, and it has worked perfectly. Never had a problem. Never, this is something that's gonna last for years, for decades. So Vitamix, you can't go wrong there either. Now, another thing I would say is, you gotta dig deep with this one. Dig deep, because I don't know your mom like you know your mom. You gotta think of what your mom loves to do. What are her hobbies besides her children? Does she like to work out? If she likes to work out, get her some new workout clothes. You're like, she has enough. No, she could always use more. Is she into photography? Get her a new camera bag. You're like, she has a camera bag. Get her a new one. Get her something different. The thing is with moms, they have a hard time shopping for themselves and not feeling guilty about it. So if you go ahead and purchase something that you really think she's gonna love, then it takes the guilt out of her having to like buy it herself. So let's say she loves makeup. Get her a gift card to her favorite place where she gets makeup. Again, it's gonna take the guilt out of her going, I don't really wanna spend the extra money for the makeup. She has a gift card from you, she has no choice but to get new makeup or to get her nails done. Don't just go with the easy route of it. We're just gonna get mom a massage. Not every mom wants a massage. Think outside the box. Think of what she likes to do. Does she like to cook or bake? Get her some new fun accessories for the kitchen. It's, you can never have too many really cute spatulas and accessories. Um, so think of her hobby. Think of what she likes to do and get her something related to that, whether it's working out or photography or watching TV or whatever it is. Though that's a really, really great way to go. Again, because Meghan Markle had her baby today with Prince Harry, they had the new royal baby, I thought, you know, this is a great time to think about our own moms, especially with Mother's Day coming up this Sunday. And so there are some great options for you to shop for mom. I'm telling you, you can't go wrong with any of those ideas. I love them all. At Actually, I have them all, including the new sunglasses. So I will put links in the description below to everything I talked about, just in case you want to run with one of these ideas or you know, maybe you wanna share it with someone you love because you're a mom and you're like, hey, I want that, hint, hint. Um, so that's it, guys. Are you super excited about the new royal baby? What are your guesses on what the baby's name is gonna be? Because they have not announced it. I think they're gonna announce it in two days. So we're, I think the whole world is waiting for the name, but what do you think the name is gonna be? Leave us a comment over on our YouTube community, or you can hop over to our Instagram and comment over there. And that's it, guys. I hope everybody's having a fantastic day, and don't forget to thumbs up this video and subscribe to our videos. And we'll talk to you later. Bye, guys.